Hello, my name is Dan Monahan, and I'm the U.S. Managing Director for Nemechexia, one of the world's leading developers of integrated structural design software. For some of you, Nemechek may be a new brand, so I wanted to take the next few minutes and introduce you to the company and share with you what our customers are doing with our technology. Some of you may be surprised to know that Nemechek is the largest AEC software developer outside the United States, in the EMEA region, Europe, Middle East, and Africa. We develop a large portfolio of software for the architecture, engineering, and construction industries. In the U.S., we're mainly known for our design-oriented brands. Software like ARCHICAD, one of the world's most popular BIM applications for architects. Vectorworks, a line of elegant 2D, 3D design software that's gone on to become the best-selling CAD program on the Macintosh and one of the leading 3D design programs on Windows. And Cinema 4D, an award-winning animation and rendering application used in Hollywood and TV for special effects and used to create stunning photorealistic client presentations. But... Outside the U.S., we're really more renowned for our engineering and construction technology. And the software that we want to introduce to you today is a program called SIA Engineer. SIA Engineer is one of the world's premier 3D structural design programs. And while it's new to you, it's not new software. It has a long development history, over 35 years. And as you'll see, it's a very proven solution that offers some very nice benefits for firms that are looking to migrate to or improve their existing 3D workflows. So, who uses SIA Engineer? Well, most of our customers are consulting engineering firms, working on interesting structures in steel and concrete. In addition, you'll find SIA Engineer in engineering departments in larger industrial firms like Siemen or Fluor or Alstrom Energy. And they work on all different types of projects, which is another advantage of SIA. It's a very flexible design program. And while most of our customers are working in the building space, either buildings that involve architects or buildings that don't, we have a large number of customers that are working on infrastructure projects, environmental projects, and energy-related projects. And we have a few special solutions for scaffolding, precast, and pre-engineered metal buildings. And here are some examples of what our clients are doing with SIA Engineer. Residential projects, typically higher-end homes done in steel or concrete, or multifamily residential projects, like this example in cold form steel. Hospital and other health science projects, I picked this project because it illustrates SIA Engineer's BIM workflow benefits. In this project, Gifford UK worked up the structural model in Revit Structures, and then used the SIA to Revit Structures link to check and optimize the Revit model. This idea of allowing an engineer to easily leverage models created by others into analysis is one way SIA is helping to support the IPD process. The other is the ability to start with the analytical model explore design ideas, optimize the design, and then pass back an optimized model to the architect or contractor for model validation or documentation. That's what AECOM did in this project. Here, SIA was used to design the new Spartak Stadium being built in Moscow for the 2018 World Cup Games. In this project, as in the case with most stadium projects, the roof structure was particularly challenging. What AECOM found is it was easier to model this non-orthogonal geometry in SIA than in Revit. So they created the model in SIA, used SIA's analysis capabilities to optimize the roof geometry, then they sent the optimized SIA model back to Revit for final documentation. This ability to start with an analysis model and from it derive an accurate physical model presents some very interesting workflows. SIA also has links for Tecla structures, ETABs, as well as offers certified support for IFC 2x3, and can also convert geometry coming in from popular modeling programs such as SketchUp, Rhino, Inventor, and SolidWorks, just to name a few. We also have a number of customers that are using SIA for institutional design, like the Student Center being constructed in steel and concrete. This is another interesting project. It was designed by Sana, a Japanese architectural firm, and it was one of the projects that the jury highlighted as an example of great architecture when awarding them the 2010 Pritzner Prize. From an engineering point of view, it's a very interesting project, as the structure is made up of these thin concrete shells that parallel one another throughout the project, but don't necessarily rest on the ground. SIA Engineer was used both for nonlinear and dynamic analysis, and was used to analyze the construction staging and simulation of the removal of the formworks in this project. It also illustrates one of SIA's key advantages, which is the ability to efficiently model these types of unusual shapes. We also have a number of clients that use SIA Engineer for the design of low-rise and high-rise buildings. In both of these projects, BSIC Engineering in Dubai 
use the SIA engineer to eTabs link to carry out third-party independent checks and to optimize the original eTabs design. For structures like these and others that contain a lot of repetition, SIA has some very nice modeling tools that make the modeling of these designs very fast and efficient. But where SIA really excels is when you have a project whose geometry or whose structural systems are a little unusual. We also have a number of customers that work on specialty structures. This is the new Confluence Museum that's being designed in Lyon, France. I picked this project because of the size and complexity of the model. One of the compliments we got from the design team was how well SIA handled this model. Despite its size, they didn't take a huge performance hit. They could still fly around in a rendered view. Zooming, panning, and screen redraws were still very fast and efficient. This isn't the case with other structural modeling software. We also have a number of customers that do work with high-end architects in Europe. This is an example of one of Daniel Liebeskin's projects in Poland. And then on the other side of the design spectrum, SIA engineers used for more industrial projects like warehouses, manufacturing facilities, plants like this new Procter & Gamble plant being built in Saudi Arabia, and mining. Energy is another sector where many companies use SIA engineer. This is an example of a new coal fire power station being built in France. This is an example of the next generation warehouse for the storage of spent nuclear fuel. Here, the structural modeling was relatively straightforward, but as you can imagine, the loading and analysis was very rigorous. The engineer in this project had to deal with special seismic loads, aircraft impact and explosion loads, as well as perform a detailed study of the soil structure interaction. We also have customers working in oil and gas, as well as offshore facilities. These are foundations for a new offshore wind farm being constructed by GOCs in the Irish Sea. Transportation and infrastructure is another industry you'll find many SIA clients working, and at all different scales. This is a new bicycle parking facility nicknamed the Apple. This project used SIA's XML export and Excel link capabilities to create a parametric study that allowed for easy design iterations and optimization. We also have customers working on tunnels and pipelines, bridges, and again, bridges at all different scales. Here's an example of a larger bridge done in steel, bridges in concrete, bridges using pre-stressed and post-tension members, and for bridges and buildings, see it can help with the analysis during the construction staging, something that's missing from some general purpose finite element packages. We also have clients working on environmental projects, dams, wastewater treatment plants, locks, and other hydro projects. And we work with a lot of companies that design large temporary structures for lifting. This temporary structures technology is also used by some companies to design scaffolding structures for maintenance, and is also used in the entertainment industry to design these types of temporary structures. This bottom one is kind of an interesting structure. It's the stage design from U2's Around the World Tour. It was designed by Stage Co. The structure may look a little familiar, as it was featured on the cover of Modern Seal Construction earlier this year. The inspiration for this project was the airport restaurant at LAX. It's an impressive 220-ton steel structure that packs into 38 tractor trailers at the end of each show, which are pretty impressive stats for a temporary structure. Well, that gives you a good intro into who we are and what our customers are doing. For more information, please visit our website at www.sia-online.com. That's www.sia-online.com. Thanks, and we hope you enjoy the rest of today's IPD Expo. Be sure to explore the rest of the Nemechek SIA booth and learn how SIA Engineer is helping firms plug into today's IPD processes. If you're an engineering firm looking to migrate to or improve your 3D workflow, we can help.